Hello and welcome, welcome to Settlement Survival. Yes, we follow the series here on the extreme difficulty. This is episode 10. So we have made 10 episodes of extreme difficulty and we're still alive, just. Um, you join me here, as you remember how it finished last time, we're in year 29. Um, we're not doing too great. We have got a problem. Um... The immigrants are just on their way, as you can see here. So we've got some here and we've got some more coming. But on the extreme difficulty, when you get them, they can also be, they can bring the plague with them. So they end up killing everyone. Um, as you can see, we need someone to build some houses and we're going to get some, we're going to go into the winter. Now, let's have a look, see, see we've got clothes, clothes are okay. Um, so we need two repair people trying to actually repair as much as they can. Um, it is quite a challenge and it is quite difficult. So we need someone doing water. Um, and obviously two people doing this. And we need some trees cut as well. So this needs to be done. Um, let's just cut them over here. They can go and actually cut that quickly. And let's start the rebuild on these houses. Alright. Some of them I do believe that need a complete reverb. Um, again, we've only got 10 people. So we need three houses, ideally, um, to start. Again, we do need some people doing some fields. But we are going into the winter. So we're going to have to just see how we go. In getting some stuff back but we all our buildings are actually dead and buried at the moment um it is a little pain in the ass as you can see we've got the christmas update now on settlement survival we've had it um since before king factory um so yeah we will see how we go on doing this again we do need to do food and we do need to do some of the rebuilding structures um we need some iron no no we've got iron ore we've got an iron we need wooden thingy as well there's a lot to be built well they're actually putting it in the stores at the moment so we have got some food what we need now is to concentrate on building the houses we've got two repair men that have got a house so Um, builders right so the builders are going to go to be fair I think they've gone too far so let's just do three builders at the moment they can actually start building these houses back up again um, get them in the house just before the winter hits we've got some more immigrants coming in as well so that might be 10 um, hopefully it is Ten citizens are cold. Yes, of course they will be. Um, and hopefully we, we will be able to... Uh, right, we've got four people that can actually do the work in. We need the houses built. So let's get that cracking on. Come on, people. Let's all work together here. Um, it is a little bit of a pain in the arse. Because we need so much stuff rebuilt say so we've got loads of sheep here but we can't do anything with them at the moment um all right that's being built so that's going to help us as well one citizens are starving that needs to be done as well this is where we get to a problem because i can't at the moment all right let's get rid of that let's just collect every resource that we can in this field i don't know if that stops people from doing a job i think it does now the builders should just build all right someone's died already we are getting to the winters and they do get very very cold here Right, 
Here they go. They're dying. One. No, dead. All ten people gone. Because the winters are terrible here. So, oh, the sheep are being moved over now. So that's that's something. So they're going to be over in this bit. So that should be empty over there. Yes. Don't worry about rebuilding that. That'll be fine. Um, so the sheep are over this section. Again, we're going to have to wait for the other immigrants. And then you've got, literally, you've got a dinky little bit of summer. And then it's really cold again. Um, so, yeah, that that is a challenge that we do have. And it's something that is causing me major issues at the moment. We've got clothes. But they're not good enough. So we need some luxury stuff produced. The issue with it is, as I say, it's not just having the food itself. Um, cause, you know, we ain't got any food, but it's just it's getting the clothing. Because winter comes, it just wipes a whole lot of them off. As you can see here, we're going to get some here. If we don't deal with this winter here, then we've got some serious problems. So... I shall bring you back when we get Welcome the other back. Welcome back. So, we have got another 10 immigrants. Now, we need to look after these because, literally, we get another 10. But, again, they could have been died because of um, the plague. It is a possibility that they could have died because of that. So, we will see where we go. We've got some more immigrants coming. But, again, they can bring the plague with them. Um, I'm hoping... That it will be okay. We need to get some houses built. So at least then they've got that. Um, we get the church done. For people that are injured. And we need someone. Cutting the lamb. So we've got four people at the moment. Winter's coming. Again this is where it's going to. It's going to kill them if it is. Uh, we need some of the lamb and meat. Right, we've got 44 mutton. That goes straight away because they're greedy. Right, we're building that. So we should have 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So everyone should be housed now. Um, once that is the case. Right, let's put someone into that. Right, that's great. So we, we've got enough houses to where we need to be. Um, let's put someone fishing to get some fish. And then we need this to be done. This needs to be graded up. We're still running on 10 people. We're okay. We haven't hit this, the winter yet. So this is where it becomes a bit of a problem. We need some water. Gavin's going to have to be the water. Um, yeah, they're feeling the cold. This is being built. Nine citizens are cold. 27. We're going down. We've lost one person already. Because I'd imagine they've got frozen. Tiffany is frozen to death. Um, what, what we probably do need to do is... Get this built as well. Still running on nine at the moment. That needs building. That is being sorted now. It's great. We've got wood. Um... We get one build up. Let's start producing that with fuel. So it's going to use 10 wood and it's going to produce fuel for us. It'll be quicker, I believe. We're still running on one person at the moment. Again, it's getting much colder. It's 8 Fahrenheit. So um, they've got houses. We need fuel. 5 Fahrenheit. Can't upgrade it, can we? We ain't got anything, can we? 
Nope. Right, that person has died. We've got three people, two people. Got two people running at the moment. Hopefully. It's not Fahrenheit at the moment, so hopefully I'm going to uh, be able to keep hold of them. But it's a big ass, Very, very big ass. Two people. We're running on two. And they've got no builders now. No repairmen either. We're not producing any fuel now because we haven't got the people to do that. Still running on two. Got one person working here, one person working there. Oh, God. I'd be amazed if we can get past winter without losing these two people. I mean, it'd be great if we, if we could carry on. Two people, right. What I want to do is do landfill. I know it doesn't seem very important, but what I want to do, I, I want to get this river joining that river. If I can. Oh, no, that's going to make it higher, isn't it? I don't want to make it higher. Yeah, that's not going to work. Right. How we doing? We've got two people still. That's good. We're getting... We are in the middle of the winter. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take one person out of there. Put them as a builder. They can get stuff building. That's still got... It's got 300 rough clothes, 90 herbs, 7 and 30 water. That's fine for the minute. If we can keep hold of these two people, that would be brilliant. Right. We've got wood, we've got that, we've got medical herbs. We've got clothes, we need to do domestic. Right. So we've got two out of the ten that we've made. Well, we had 20 immigrants there, and we've only managed to save two at the moment. Um, that isn't great. We are really holding on. Why right, is that being built? It's started to be built. Well, that's something that we're going to have to do as well. Well, it looks like we've managed to save them too. We've got more immigrants coming in, so we will have 12. Right. Where are they? There they are. There's one of them. Building all houses that doesn't really need to be built. There he goes. I keep losing him. Where's he going? Oh, there he is. Right, let's take the person out of there for a minute. Let the sheep do what they need to do. It gives us one labour at the moment. Um, we can be doing bits and bobs. He's going to be start doing that. There's a labourer here. Why it's warmer, I'll get them actually doing something. Citizens are starving. That's a problem, it's, it's, it's the uh, labour side. At the moment, it'd be alright because they'd be able to live off the little plants that they get. 
but the other immigrants are coming in and we haven't got any food ready for them. If we, can, if we can get this built, then at least then I can put some people in there and they can start eating. So, um, yeah, that would be something. Right, what have we got in there? Wall, leather. Loads of reed. Oh, they're collecting plants. Let's see what she does with these. You know what she's done there. Is she still collecting or not? Oh, that's got to be built. So, is that being built now? Yeah, it started to. Right, we've got some food in there, so he can go and get some food. No, he's going to carry on working. Oh, we did have food, but it's all disappeared. Right, the immigrants going to be coming now, so I want one person doing the mutton. Um... One person that to produce some fuel. We've got some more coming as well. The problem is, it is, it is the... Um, oh, we've got a child. Oh, that's Andy. It was a male, male and female, obviously, that was left over. And they've had a kid, so... Um, that's good news for us. Right, here comes the more immigrants. So we're going to have one in here, one in there. Is this, if this is built, it's going to be built in a minute. One person can go in there. Yeah, of course we'll take care. Uh... Right, so one in here. One doing water. One in the market. That's good. We've run out of tools, so we need tools to be rebuilt. Right. Going for the winter again. We need to make sure we get some food somewhere along the line. We've got two people collecting that. Help us with a bit of the rough food. We've got no tools, so we can't build anything now. We can build that, though, so hopefully that that become uh, will become pretty good. All right, we'll have to see how this winter goes to see if we survive it or not. Am I building that or that? Hope it's not that one. Right. Now they can get the resources there, but how are they going to build if they've got no iron tools? This would be interesting. Because we've got no tools left. There is literally no tools at all. It'd be interesting to see how this works. We shot by one house. Oh, God. There we are. We shot by one house. Got no tools, no tools. Right. Oh, it's working. Oh, well, that'd be handy. I thought we was gonna, I thought there was going to be a bit of a game over there. Fuel reserves low, yes, I know that. We're working on that at the moment. That is producing some of the fuel for us. The 
these citizens are starving. Alright, that's producing that. I do need to get this built over here. Then we need to get a hunter. As you can see, there's, there is a lot of food around. Right, we're hanging on at the moment. We're just getting into... We're minus seven, so this is where they're going to drop. If they're going to drop anywhere, this is where it's going to happen. Because it is, it is in minus figures now. Here we go. One died. Put more people out labouring at the moment. How many got in there? We've got one person doing the water. This is being built now. We can get someone doing some tools. So we've got some tools. Thirsty as well. Right, that's just about to finish. So we we'll grab... We put one of the labourers in there um, to produce it. I'm quite lucky I've got the food. I mean, we're going past really slim line at the moment. Come on. We are 16 Fahrenheit. We've lost two people so far. Oh, nearly... Where's this person? Excellent. All right, one big order out. That person doing that and doing that. Excellent. Right, we're gonna make some tools. I'm hoping that we're making some fuel reserve. 16 so that should get us 20 domestic fuel all right we still need water that we're doing we're coming out of winter and we have we've lost two people so far died of starvation that isn't is no surprise really because obviously we are suffering that from ourselves It is a bit of a pain in the arse at the moment. But we're getting there, we're getting there. So, right, well, as we're just coming out of the winter there, we've lost a couple of people or so, guys. I'm going to leave it there. That has been another episode of Settlement Survival on the Extreme Difficulty. If you like the video, please give it a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. It does me wonders. Until next time, I shall see you in another video. See you later.